I'm Matt Camp, Los Angeles Dodgers center fielder. Awesome. The difference between maple and ash is, well, me, I prefer ash because uh, it feels better in my hands. It's more balanced to me, and it's just lighter. Um, uh, maple is more, it's, for me, it's heavier. It's a little unbalanced at times, and uh, you know, I just don't have a good feel for it. So I, I prefer, I prefer ash. I look for the grains in the bat. I, uh, for me, I, the grains like the, Rollins, I think has some of the the best uh, ash. I mean that I've ever used. I hit the most home runs with the, with the with the Rollins bat. So I just look for the, the straight grains. The, the less grains, I think for me is the better the bat. So I get one, pick one of those out, and, and go to work with it. Cool. The difference between the big stick and the velo. On the big stick, it's a, a bigger barrel bat. I guess you would say it's for the, the bigger guys, like a, a, a model 243, and, and the Velo is it's more like a, a 271 balanced balance bat, and uh, you know you can get the bat through through faster. Well, I, I'm a big guy, but I prefer a, a more balanced bat, um, like Ash, a C271 model. I like that, so uh, I would go with the Velo. Uh, I think it's it's part of the game. Um, you know, you can have your ups and your downs, but uh, for me, if, if you just have fun and, you know, kind of just take it game by game, you, you get out of those little funks that you get into. Um, you know, I don't, I don't really take the game, I'm not going to say I don't take it too serious. I take it serious, but I like to have fun, and, and you can't let, it, let the, up, uh, the down stress you out. You know, you just got to go out there and have fun, and uh, you get through that, those, those tough times. Well, for me, is I just, I might go look at videos, or I might go look at, at uh, in the past when I was swinging really good, just, just look, you look at positive things. You don't go back and look at the negative things like on video. You don't look at the bad at bats. I just look at good at bats. And uh, it kind of shows you what you're, what you're doing right. And it, you get that in your, in your, in your, in your head and, and you just, just take it there, out there on the field with you. Well, for me, if I think if I swing too hard, I'm not, I'm not that good of a player. For me, I just got to square the ball up and let my strength take over. I don't, I think I'm not really good at, at going up there and trying to hit home runs. If I try to hit a home run, I'm going to look pretty bad. So I just try to go up there and make solid contact, and if it, it goes out the park, it goes out the park. If you, if you try too hard, um, usually the, you're, you're, you're not going to have too much success. Uh, you're going to try to do too much. You're going to swing at bad pitches. You know, just try to get a good pitch to hit, see the ball, and uh, just try to take it back up the middle. And, you know, whatever happens, happens. I'm just trying to see the ball up, trying to get a good pitch to hit, you know, not, not swing at the zone. You know, pitchers try to bait you, try to get you to swing at a bad pitch when they're up in the count. So, you know, just try to see them up and, uh, you know, hit the ball back up the middle or the other way. No, my favorite baseball players growing up were, were Gary Sheffield, Frank Thomas, and Ken Griffey Jr. Those were my, my top three. So I try to, when I was a kid, I was trying to be like them, especially Frank Thomas. I was a bigger kid growing up, so they called me the little, the little big hurt. So that's my little nickname when I was in, uh, in uh, grade school.